What's going on nerds? I'm Daily Cycle and welcome back to another best class setups video. This is a series where I show you guys my favorite class setups for different weapons in Infinite Warfare. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Hornet. The Hornet is a fully auto ballistic pistol that delivers the highest fire rate and recoil across all weapon classes, meaning that this weapon shoots the fastest in the game and has the most recoil in Infinite Warfare. So with that being said, we're going to play to this weapon's strengths and weaknesses. The Hornet is going to put a lot of rounds down range very quickly, but it's also going to kick straight up whenever you start firing this weapon. With that being said, the class setup that we're going to be looking at is called the Horny. Get it? Anyway, the attachments that we're going to have on the Hornet are the extended mags and hollow point. There are a couple reasons why we need extended mags on the Hornet. One, it's our primary weapon, so we're going to have to have enough ammo to take out multiple enemies if that comes up. Not to mention, it shoots really fast, so we're going to need more ammo in that clip to be able to take out multiple enemies if they do show up like that. The other attachment hollow point is vital because like I said the Hornet is going to kick straight up and if you have hollow point you will get a headshot almost every time depending on the situation though but this will help you kill enemies so much faster and save your ammo as well as help you stay alive. For your lethal equipment I like to use the tar but you can use whatever you want. The reason I use the tar is because you can throw it really quickly and move on. For the tactical equipment, I like to use a personal radar so that I can know where enemies are very easily. As for your perks, in perk 1, I have dexterity as well as ghost. You don't really need ghost because you're going to be shooting and you're going to be visible on the radar. I just like to be hidden until I start killing enemies. As for dexterity, you're going to need to reload very quickly and you're going to need to reload all the time. So you're going to want to have dexterity on this class. Scavenger is also vital for this class because you're going to be wasting so much ammo killing enemies, especially if you try to take them on far away. And Hardwired is a staple for me. I like using Hardwired in almost all of my classes. Same with Ghost, but Ghost I'll take off every once in a while depending on what I want to do and what the game mode is. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, that's it for this video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Check out more episodes for best class setups by clicking on the link in the description below. And if you want to suggest a gun for me to do next, don't forget to leave it down in the comments. But I do have a few lined up already, so it may take a couple videos for me to get to your suggestion. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.